It was Grand Chief Wilton Littlechild's TRC call to action number 58, which stated the Pope should apologize in Canada to residential school survivors and their families. That led to Pope Francis coming on this trip. The Truth and Reconciliation Commissioner was in his home of Muskwachis, Alberta, to welcome Pope Francis seven years after the TRC finished its report. In his first Canadian stop, the Pope apologized for the harms caused by the Catholic Church. Now, with some time to talk to survivors, Chief Littlechild says that many have accepted the apology, and he understands those who don't. The elderly people, former students, are quite open and have accepted the apology. But the younger people say that's not good enough. We want more. We want action. Not just words, action. What's going to happen now? So there's that. It's not a division. I think it's a good combination. A willingness to forgive, a willingness to accept an apology, but knowing full well that for many that's not good enough. His gifting of his grandfather's headdress to Pope Francis was controversial to many. Little Child says the idea was not his own and proper protocols were followed, including a sweat lodge. When the committee asked what should we give him as a gift, there was three committees, a national committee, a provincial committee, and a local committee. And he did get a name in Rome. <clears throat> and one of the elders suggested we should give him a headdress. So I said, I have one. One of the Muscatus elders? Yeah. Little Child thinks some people took it too far with comments on social media for gifting the headdress. That created, apparently, I'm not on social media, but apparently a lot of people are angry at me for doing that. But I don't tell them, where were you when the prime minister got a headdress? Where were you when the president of a company got a headdress? Where were you when others got headdresses? Why this one? So it was a personal gesture of reconciliation, and I feel good about it. APTN asked what happens next. Where were you going to go? On a path of reconciliation together? Chris Stewart, APTN National News, Muskogee, Alberta.